I sketched this on the back of the flight plan, 35,000 feet mid-Atlantic. <laughs> and uh, came back, got a designer here in town to draw it up, and did it. So I started thinking, I'll just build a small tasting room, and then later when things recover, then build the tasting room, you know? And then I thought, well, what do I do with a small one? Tear it down? That's a waste. And then I thought, because well, I pictured all along a gazebo over here. You take a bottle of wine, cheese crackers, come over here and have it. But build the gazebo first and enclose it, make it all weather. I've been doing wineries for years. You know, I'm flying for Delta, I get a layover, get a car, and hit the wine trailers. Anywhere I've lived as I moved around the country flying for different airlines, hit every wine trail in the area. And then uh, flying for Europe, uh, Europe for five years, dragging wine home and built the wine cellar. And, you know, it's just been a passion, you know. Yes. I bought this property and it's suited for it, so. It's been a natural evolution, you know, a place to go, to move into my golden years, if you will. I read books that I was sick of reading. <laughs> and then uh, the other wineries on the Pioneer Watcher have been very gracious and helpful. And Kip Barber at Lono Vineyard has been really mentoring me. And so I just jumped in. Well, we, we say that Cabernet Franc, Cabernet Franc Reserve is our flagship red. And that our late harvest recently would be our flagship white. The uh, production goals are a thousand cases a year, that's all. I'm more going for quality over quantity. I'm on reserve, um, so I'm on a beeper X number of days a month, and uh, somebody called in sick, they had an airplane break or something, they call me. So that did, does give me a lot of free time, although I have to feel ready to go on a, on a, on a call. I schedule my vacation for the crush. So, all my vacation in October. Um, we're only open on weekends initially, weekdays by appointment. So if I'm on call, but I'm here, somebody wants to drop by, you know, with that understanding, I may have to do it. <laughs> and I can't join you. <laughs> we'll grow as, you know, as things develop.